basically we started out uh, with funding from just the CSU. Um, the CSU is on contract with the Hive Cafe to provide, um, it's approximately like $42,000 a year for the Hive to operate the Hive, the Hive Free Lunch program. Um, and then that about a year ago wasn't quite enough <laughs> because I was operating a, like alone as a full-time employee and then having one part-time assistant that I wasn't able to pay as much as I was making. And for a non-hierarchical setting, that doesn't really make um, sense. So um, I was able to get some grants to be able to um, top up our funding for that year. And then there was an ASFA referendum um, and we secured a 10 cent per credit ASFA fee levy. So it's the arts and science faculty students that provide 10 cents per credit um, towards the high free lunch. And we just started getting that this past year. So that has allowed us to maintain having two full-time coordinators that make the same amount of money per hour um, and have the same amount of hours. So we work interchangeably. Um, and then we pay for our food. So um, right now we're not getting free food um, because of logistical reasons, <laughs> but also because um, the organization that provides many um, of these types of organizations free food, Moisson Montréal, didn't have um, space for us right away when we were able to start setting it up. So likely we'll start having that in um, fall of 2017. But right now we're paying for our food. Um, in general, we spend about 73 cents per student. Uh, per day on food and it comes to about 63 cents per serving served um, Which is pretty good <laughs> but um, a Lot of our budget goes to food right now And we're trying to make that shift to be able to get more free food so that we're able to spend more money on organic ingredients rather than having to get the cheapest ingredients available to be able to continue to serve the growing amount of people that we do serve